So hello guys, I just want to show you this amazing Amazon find. Um, one of the problems we have as braiders is actually finding the right pattern comb. It's really, really very important. And I can sincerely tell you I have gone through a lot of these combs, a whole lot. Some breaks, some um, the rat's tail comes off and things like that. But I found this one on Amazon. It doesn't have a name. It doesn't, it doesn't have a brand name. It just came like this. And it came six in the pack. So don't begin to ask me um, where can I get it. You can get it on Amazon. But you have to go look for it yourself. Just know that it is pink. It came six like this. And this thing is basically like, I think it was $6 or $7 something for the six of them. And since I got it, I've just been using one. I um, actually like took out a few, maybe like seven or eight of them. I took out a few of it. But if you look at, if you look at the tip, look at it very well, you will see what I'm talking about. And then this thing is so strong. It is really, really very strong here that I don't think it's gonna be, it's gonna break so easily like the popular black um, rat tail comb you get from the grocery store. So if you wanna make an investment, I will advise you to make this and it's really cheap. It's basically like less than $2 for each one because I got this for less than seven, um, dollars but i wouldn't advise you to go buying it alone on amazon because you have then to have to pay shipping on it so i got it with other um items and it came with free shipping so what i did was because most times i like having more than one comb in case i have multiple clients in a day I could just like use different combs for different people until I have time to like wash them out. So I have um, this one. You could use a knife. I think I used the blade on that one. You could... So guys, however way you can cut it out, just cut it out. That is what I want to show you. Okay. Why I don't like breaking it is when you break it, it tends to have a sharp edge. So I need to also smoothen that one out. So it's better to use something and just cut it out. Don't break it off. It's going to have um, a sharp edges, which at the end of it all is going to end up sticking to someone's hair, which is what you most certainly don't want. You want to cut it and have something like this or even smoother. All right. You can even use, um, what is it called? your nail file to file it down and get a smooth finish. That is all I have for my Amazon find today. I do hope you, if you have problems with getting the right pattern comb, I do hope you check it out and um, it saves you money. All right, thank you for watching. Bye for now.